Pip also has uh, some duality to tra with Trab's boy, and I talk more about Trab's boy in the uh, the social aspects of the Victorian era in the written lecture. But there are some commonalities there, and I'm not going to go into those because I want to talk about uh, other dualities within the uh, um, within the book. And one of the other characters who has a huge duality is Wimmick. Wimmick is Jagger's uh, hired man. He works for Jaggers. And at first we don't know much about Wimmick, but Wimmick and Pip actually become friends. And when they do become friends, friends, Wimmick asks him asks Pip to come to his house and spend the night. And Pip is amazed when he gets to Wimmick's house because uh you know it's built like a castle and there's a cannon, there's the stinger and there is the aged parent. And when uh, they get to the house, to the castle, and Pip asks um, Wimmick, what is, uh, uh, you know, Mr. Jaggers thinks of this. Does he admire it? And Mr. Wimmick says, he does never been here. He's never going to be here. And he, and he tells Pip, he says, you know, what happens at the office happens at the office. And what happens at home happens at home. And he doesn't want Pip to even tell Jaggers about the castle and the aged parent. Now, why doesn't women, Wimmick want Jaggers to know? Because I think it would taint his home. Very, very, very clear case of duality. Very, very, um, you know, striated. And at home, Wimmick is like a different man. You know, he is the king of his castle. And then after they spend the night and they go back to the office the next morning... Dickon writes, and again, I'm not giving you the chapter and verse because I do detail it in, um, in, in the writing, or excuse me, in the written language le lecture. Wimmick becomes quiet. He becomes drawn. And when he gets back to the office, it's as if the castle and the aged parent and the girl with the fresh face didn't even exist. Now, interestingly enough, Wimmick is one of the most sane characters in Great Expectation. Miss Havisham is certainly not sane. Mrs. Joe, she might be sane, but she's, you know, so greedy. Uh, so maybe I should say Wimmick is one of the most balanced people in the book. You see characters all around. Jaggers, Estella, who has been ruined by Miss Havisham. Um, even Pip himself. Out of balance. But Wimmick, in his duality, is very balanced. So, the Victorian era is one of great contrast, great dualities. And we see this reflected in the novel Great Expectations. Look for other dualities. See if you can find them. But pay particular attention to the ones that I've already mentioned. And, you know, just stay on top of those and uh, see if you can find out even more details.